My name is Sarah Connor. We changed the future. Saved three billion lives. <laughs> You're welcome. I think for fans of the franchise, the biggest thing by far is that Linda's returning. Sarah Connor is in the story. She's returned to the story, which is, for me, being a huge fan of the franchise, that was it for me. I don't think any of us really imagined that we would want to create a Sarah Connor that wasn't played by Linda. And then the question became, does Linda want to come back? I felt very much that I had worked a very complete character arc in the first two films, from a nobody to a warrior. I didn't want to just keep doing them without the ability to add something to the character arc. I actually wrote her a very logical email about uh, why it would be great for her to do this. My argument was people love this character. People love Sarah. They love your Sarah. Why do you care what happens to her? Because I was her. Sarah Connor just feels so important to the history of cinema and, and action, and obviously she's a woman and that's important, but she's also just a cool evolution of a human being. Sarah Connor, it's such an icon, and he was one of the first female superheroes that we had. It's really interesting to go back into our story, and Sarah has lived through events that are from a future that never happened, because she changed it at the end of Terminator 2. It was hard to figure out where Sarah Connor is now. Who is she now? Is she a complete lunatic alcoholic? I suggested that she be fat, because then I wouldn't have to work so hard, but that didn't work. Sarah reminds me of the seasoned sports player that's been on a championship team for years and years and is able to coach the youngsters. Linda comes to the set prepared every fucking day. She wants to do all of her stunts. I will always go as far as I can into a character, but there are limits at my age. I had to go to training camp in Texas for weapons and unlearn what I knew in 1991 because everything has changed. So that button you gotta push kinda hard. Yep, if I can find it. <laughs> when you see Linda Hamilton kicking ass and taking names, it's Linda Hamilton kicking ass and taking names. It's not a stunt double. Linda is a great, great addition to this film. And I think that Cameron and the other writers, they knew how to bring her back in a very organic way. When you see the film, when Sarah comes into the movie, you just feel this amazing sense of, okay, here we go. She's back, she's bad.